Captain Rex Vallalbi, V-I-L-A-U-B-I, -I, Fire Station 63. And so what time did you guys get the call today? We got it just a little bit after, after midnight. Uh, we responded to a structure fire at this residence. We got on scene. We saw a fire coming from the front windows. And a, uh, one of the local residents reported that they had patients inside or persons screaming. At that time, firefighters went in and made an aggressive attack on the fire. Started to get a knockdown. At the same time, uh, firefighter Hayes, we sent him in for a search and found the one patient in the uh, rear living quarters, uh, kind of a den, uh, face down. What do you know about the victim at this time? Uh, we don't know. We do know that we did pull him out. Uh, we were able to uh, support a rescue, successful rescue. He was alive and breathing when we pulled him out of the building. We transported him to a near hospital. Sounds good. Is the uh, victim expected to survive at this time? Uh, we don't know. We don't know his condition yet, and we'll determine that once they get to the hospital. Sounds good, sir. Do we have a cause of the fire at this time? Not yet. It's still an investigation. Sounds good. Name is Scott. One more time. Uh, Captain Rex Vallabi, V-I-L-A-U-B-I. Robert Hayes, H-A-Y-S. And sir, uh, you guys responded to a structure fire right here tonight. Tell me a little bit about what you were faced with when you arrived on scene. Uh, when we arrived on scene, we had fire blowing out the rear and front of the building, the side. Uh, smoky conditions inside, and we had team go to the roof, and we went inside for, uh, I was assigned to search and rescue. When you were inside the building, what, uh, what kind of conditions were in there? Was the building fully involved inside, and how much fire are we talking about? We had, at that time, looked like in the rear we had one room that was fully involved at the time. The conditions inside were uh, very heavy smoke. Once you got in there, what did you discover? Uh, in the back bedroom, uh, lying face down, we found uh, one patient. Once you found that patient, did you guys pull him out, or how did you guys Yes, out? three of us that were on the uh, rescue team pulled the victim out to the front. That's unbelievable. At the time you pulled the, uh, the person out of the building, was he conscious of breathing? Uh, it was hard to tell. It was hard to tell when we brought him out with smoke. We had paramedics on scene that assisted him right away and uh, took care and got him to the hospital. Absolutely fantastic. So your name and spelling and what fire station are you Robert Hayes, H-A-Y-S, Fire Station 63.